What's happening everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Adam, this is Van City Audi. We are back at the new and improved rider performance for the first modification here on the B9S4. Today, we're going to hopefully lessen the drivetrain slop. Now, we've already improved that situation when we installed the JXB driveshaft carrier, and I'm hoping that we can improve it even more. Today, we're gonna be installing CTS's transmission insert. I'm hoping this kind of locks it down even further and we get even more responsive shifts. It's a very, very quick install, which we'll let Kyle get to right now, and then I'll quickly get out to the back roads of Mexico and do some performance tests to see if I can feel any difference and see if I can lessen that drivetrain slop. So a super quick and painless install here at Rider Performance. Time to get out to the back roads of Mexico and see how this car feels. First test is to launch the car in AMAX mode. Maximum acceleration without any torque reduction between shifts so there's not gonna be any farts. And I'll see how much drivetrain slop we have, see if there's any improvement now that I have this CTS turbo transmission insert. Pump up the itty bitty brakes and let's give her hell. <laughs> yeah very secure very secure that felt really really good now it's hot as hell out so my car probably isn't making as much power which is making it less absurd of a, a thump or a whack or any kind of movement in the drivetrain, but that felt very, very good. So the next one I'm gonna do is I'm going to do it without AMAX mode, where you get a little bit of a fart, what you guys would experience while you're daily driving. Now for a test, just rolling like you would be daily driving and then you get on it. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Oh, that feels good. Definitely, definitely an upgrade that I should have done sooner. Well, those runs felt freaking great. I've spent an additional 20 to 25 minutes driving around, ripping around back roads, upshifting and downshifting to kind of feel what I feel. Most noticeable was the gear changes while in AMAX mode. Off of launch with no torque reduction through those gear changes, that's where I noticed this the most. Very, very secure, no movement, just ripping through the gears. Now I need to remind you guys that I also have a JXB drive shaft carrier installed. It is not just the CTS turbo insert that I'm using. So I'm benefiting from both to have less drivetrain slop. I feel like I have the winning ticket now. It feels very well sorted and very well planted. Like my drive shaft's not moving all over. The transmission on gear changes is in where it needs to be and not moving around. Feels awesome. I, I don't have anything negative to say. It feels great. So I'm just looking forward to getting back to the track. See if those gear changes are even snappier and more pronounced during the quarter mile runs at the racetrack and see if I can go even quicker. I got something else in store for you guys before I do that though. So stay tuned to the channel to find out what that is. One more modification before I get back to the drag strip to see what my now stage two E85 B9S4 can do in the quarter mile. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, take care.